So earlier this summer, Mary Kate found somebody that was selling grapevines for making wine. And it's always been one of those things that we thought would be fun to do. So we took those grapevines, brought them back to the farm, and had a fun summer side project of trying to figure out how to build a trellis for grapevines. two primary ways to create an end post. One is to use an H brace, or like we decided to do, use an anchor. my blood meal, bone meal, and some worm castings, and I mixed it with some peats moss. And I'm just going to put them around my grapevines just to infuse the soil with a little bit of nutrients because I know it's definitely lagging. So I'm out of breath. So at the beginning of the summer, my dad put up this thing to try to catch honeybees because all of our honeybees like disappeared at the beginning of the spring for some reason. I thought he was crazy, but it actually worked. Mm -hmm. So now we have the challenge of moving them from this hive to their permanent hive. Should be interesting. Mm -hmm. See if there's any a sign of a queen here. Mm -hmm. 
Got a little bit of brood up through here and down through here. Be some good honey right there. There we go. Welcome home. There you go. Success. Hey, bud. And now it's time to string this wire between the posts. Definitely a two man job. Toward the middle of the section of fence where the pull in each direction will be equal. First, cut the wire at the desired place in the fence run, then place two 12 and a half gauge sleeves on one end of the wire and bend the wire back onto itself. Now you Okay, so this goes in, this goes in here, mm -hmm. a wire comes through here, and then through here, mm -hmm. and then you twist this, Okay. and then that wire comes through here, mm -hmm. and you ratchet it. Like that. Finally, the last step, put in the anchors to support the imposts. Um, I'm just going to tie this guy on here so they can figure out how to latch to it. In fact, a couple of these guys already started latching themselves to this wire. So, um, But once they outgrow this wire, we'll add subsequent wires up and up. Every They're spaced every 12 inches or 24 inches. There's a guy for it online that I'm going to follow. So um, should be good to go. But thanks for watching today, guys, and we'll see you next time.